Hey guys, it's your boy Piston Cup Productions here with a quick announcement. We are starting a new vlog channel. Now, the new channel is my brother's old YouTube channel that was called Cruz Ramirez Studios. So if you have already subscribed to that channel when it first started, no need to do anything. You're going to be subscribed to it and you'll be seeing videos on there regularly. If you haven't subscribed though, I will link it in a pinned comment or in the description of the video, whichever is easiest. We're just going to be uploading stuff like vlogs, behind the scenes content from this channel, maybe like hangouts, trips travel you know cool stuff like that um it's just something new that we want to try out and we're going to see how it does so if you haven't already subscribed go subscribe to pcp vlogs a lot of cool content coming soon january 22nd nine in the morning at my local walmart and i'm pretty sure this is the case that has the alien light yuma queen because if i'm not mistaken these are also in the assortment and I am late. These were already like this, so someone's obviously been here. <sighs> Damn it, man. Well, I'm gonna go to a couple more Walmarts and check if I can find more of this case, but it's finally hitting my area. It's just, I was too late somehow. I'm not gonna be here at six in the morning, bro. That's That's too early, but. I'll pick it up right now. Don't worry. But, man, I'm, I'm trying to see if, like, it's hidden somewhere or anything. But I'll get the Mater and the McQueen, even though they're not new. Well, they're new Thailand variations or whatever. This one I'm pretty sure I already have. But same with this guy and this guy. Ah, oh, man. Okay, on to the next door. Second Walmart of the trip. No sign of KC, unfortunately. But there is a sign of new color changers. Another rendition of brand new Mater. I believe they've done a color very similar to this back in the glory days of cars. But the new one, and I'm sure the one everyone's going to be after, is Jeff Corvette right here. That's a really nice one. I've been actually wanting that one, so I'm going to pick that one up. I just like how it goes from yellow to red. Simple color combo, really, because they do it with McQueen all the time, but it looks really good on Jeff. Uh, I don't see, or I don't think, there's any other new one for the color changers i think it's just those two guys so we'll pick up jeff thank the lord jesus <laughs> i found it there's only one i think let me check the rest of the pegs see if there's another one made her with sign cactus mcqueen okay looks like they had two cases of this so someone bought the other one but you know what i wanted two of them but i'm fine with just one so i'm here at my local mall and usually this store only sells hot wheels but look what they have now they sell cars and the one case they get is one of the rarest cases of 2023 and i think these are five dollars and fifty cents each which is insane considering how expensive west philanthropus misty and cryptid buster mater were a couple months ago the name of the store is New Sun Racing. I don't know if there's more of these stores in America, but there's a couple of them in my area, so I'm gonna go check if I can find more of these. So it is Friday, February 16th, and this is new. They really haven't promoted Glow Racers that much, Mattel, you know? So it's really random to just see this. So we got, you know, the four pack, that Mac, that place, and that. And this is also new. I'll be picking this one up for the review. I know a lot of people have been wanting for me to review this that McQueen looks sick also the Frank and that retails for 20 bucks which is not bad they did something similar like this years ago so it's great to see a uh, finally somewhat restock uh, new color changes Mac is out too I'll ask if they have that in the back as far as singles and all that other stuff everything looks pretty normal I don't think I'm gonna get this though just this one right here nobody beats me they don't say any special phrases. It's just the same stuff they always say. Okay, so now Target has Cryptid Buster Mater. <laughs> That's so random, but hey, good for Target, I guess. A uh, whole, almost a year later, but, well, no, these haven't even been out for a year. But you get the joke I'm trying to make. This little guy's here, too. Jeez, this place is a mess. Someone raided the place before me. I don't think there's anything I need from this case, though, thankfully. I mean, I have all the cars from 2023, thankfully. I was able to find them throughout the year. 
but for anyone still looking for cars like these i mean they're here at target so definitely hit up your stores I'm trying to see if there's anything else that's a highlight in this case. Mm, pretty sure it's just stuff like, yeah, Cryptid Buster McQueen. Well, I forgot my watch, but my brother has his. So yeah. what is today? February 18th. February 18th out of Target. And I see that they have the new mobile paint shop Mac. I'm going to be getting that one for a review. You know, it's crazy. When I said I wanted to stop doing color changer videos, now they come out with the good stuff. So I'll be getting that one. There's only two left in stock, so I'm assuming they've been selling pretty well. They're $30 each. Um, I picked this one up at a different store. And then I said I wasn't going to get this one, but I think it might be good for a video, so I'll get that one. As far as everything else, everything's pretty basic. I'm still looking for the new glow racers of uh, Chase and Fillmore, but I haven't seen them. And they restocked on those two packs from this year, but those have been selling out pretty quickly. But I'll be getting the the Mac placer for sure. Good morning, everyone. Good Welcome morning. back. Um, we're going on vacation, quote unquote. Not really. We're going to work. We're going to be, can I even say it? Um, yeah, I'm the movie's probably going to be out by the time this gets uploaded, yeah. but I'm recording uh remake of racing like a fireball and we gotta go to the beach it's like a two hour drive um there's a couple stores on the way we'll probably stop by and see but i'm still kind of sleepy and i have to do most of the driving what time did you sleep <sighs> like 12 a.m 12 a.m me like at 1 a.m so i only got like five ish hours of sleep six mm -hmm. yeah it's it's about to be seven in the morning wait Five, six, seven. Can't count. I can't count for shit. I gotta film this, get it done. It's gonna come out on my birthday, March 23rd. This is the second Walmart we've came to. The first one I didn't record to because it was absolutely nothing. Like for shit, there was nothing. And I came here thinking I was gonna find the cruise holder. I found another Space Creature McQueen. Um, that's case C, D? I completely forgot. Or B? I don't know. Point is, I thought I would see the Cruiser Mirrors holder. And no, it's, it's an older assortment. Unfortunately, I thought I would find it here. I'm gonna record the first scene of the remake movie, whatever. Remastered. Uh, Any day now. Come on, you can't <laughs> rush art. <laughs> Alright, here we go. The fucking string broke. Bro! Interesting. It's about to be March and they're. I mean. I'm not complaining, right? These are cool and all, but it's just the fact that they are getting them so late. It's a cool case, though. There's only, what, Flo, Sally, and Ramon. So I'm assuming someone else was here and they took the main characters, or maybe it was just a parent. And I don't think my targets are ever gonna get the Glow Racers Fillmore. And, uh, chase race lot. So finally, here we are at HEB with the 2024 Easter cars. A complete set. These look really good. They are a little pricey though. 548. Oh, the Easter buggy. We got that one already. Same with this Bunny Ears McQueen. Uh, anyways, there's a lot of people saying they are finding these at TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Ross, and apparently Ollie's. And I have not seen those at all. So I'm gonna have to get them here for full price, which kind of sucks but hey at least it's a full set minus mater someone really came in here bought mater and left everything else the hunt continues february 27th you're at heb and there's a complete set of the vehicles now i did not find mater last time and there's only one here so i'll be picking him up he does look different and there is some hot wheels as well um those are i guess are a set too there's Flo. she's also kind of rare because she's the only one easter buggy ramon there's those McQueens as well, but where, where do you go? Mater. Yes, this is the one I needed, so let's pick them up. It is March 3rd, and the Cruiser Mirrors holder just came out, and sure enough, there it is. Is it really the only one? Yeah, I guess it is. So I don't know if these come like in cases of A and someone bought the other one, but I just need the one, so I'll be picking this one up. About time they come out with a new damn holder, because it was only those for like the longest time. And now they finally came out with one. This one looks really nice. Can't wait to review this one. 
nearly 20 bucks so i remember back in my day they were like 13 to 15 bucks but oh well that's inflation for you I'm not entirely sure if this is for every target but it's worth checking out if you're still wanting the florida 500 speedway i think that's a decent price for it march 18th and huh who would have thought target restocking i think this is case a So we're here at Target. I bought myself some Prime, bro, because this is like limited edition. And we're here for Pizzica Brothers, the birthday boy. He bought some stuff. For I bought birthday. some stuff for myself. And we're, we're both gonna try this UC Prime. And I bought two because, you know, I'm like that. I was looking for the one that said like the letter D and that one will have like the new ones I'm looking for so and like like all the ones you brought me say C so it's like oh okay they're all the same but like I still appreciate you bringing them oh shit March 26th hype we got a new case the one with President Mater hell yeah let's see what else okay there's the King Otis Luigi and Guido Todd Marcus McQueen Oh, Wingo with Flames. That's another new one from Thailand. I'll pick that one up. Who else is new here? Brush Kerber. I think this might be two cases. So someone probably was here and bought the other President Mater. I think, I would assume. Fabulous McQueen looks really good on this artwork too. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, so I think there's only two new ones here. But still great scores nonetheless. Finally, I've been wanting that mater for so long. <sighs> Guys, I need a vent. So, I just went to a Target right now, right? I've been here hundreds of times, right? And this is probably one of the first experiences at Target that was just absolute shit in a, in a long time. So, my local Target had told me that this other Target I was going to had 70 some cars in the back or in stock. And so I was like, okay, I'm gonna go and see if they can bring them out for me, hoping it's case D or something with the Ghost Tractor and Slime McQueen. Because apparently people are finding that one at Target. Like Target just snapped out of nowhere. I was like, hey, here's a bunch of 2024 cases, have fun. So I'm like, bet, I'm gonna go look for them. Hopefully they're there. I get there, the pegs are full of, I think it's case A of 2024. I asked this guy that's in the toy section. I'm like, hey, I'm looking for these cars that another location said you guys have in the back. Could you bring them out for me? And he goes, oh, if the box is sealed, I can't give it to you. I can't open it because the pegs are already full. I'm like, okay. I was like, that's not a problem. I was like, if you want, I could just buy the whole box. Cause I mean, the whole point of a business is that you want to sell, right? So I'm like, I even offered, I was like, I'll buy the whole box. And then, you know, like another day I'll just return the extras, you know, whatever. Like he's not going to know. He's not going to care. But even like that, he was like, no. And then he's like, do you want me to call a supervisor? And I was like, that's not necessary. I was like, I get it. He's like, are you sure? I was like, I wanted to see where this was going to go. So I was like, you know what? Yeah, sure. Call a supervisor. Let's see what they're going to tell me. So he gets on his radio. I wish I recorded the freaking incident too, dude, because it got bad. So he radios on the, uh, on his thing and he's like, supervisor, uh, aisle, blah, 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 whatever aisle the car section is. And one lady pulls up 
and she's like, oh, hi, how can I help you? And I explained the whole situation. I'm like, hey, I'm looking for these cars. Um, they're telling me there's a box sealed in the back, but they can't bring it for me. And I, ext I start explaining to her that she doesn't even have to open the box for me, that I just needed to read the letter printed on the cardboard box. Because you know, the cases from cars, they say letter A, case A, B, C, D. And I was like, as long as I see the letter I need on the box, then I'll buy the box. But if it says like letter, I told her, if it says A, B, or C, I'm not gonna buy them because those are cars I already have. And she's like, oh yeah, sure, no problem. She's like, I'll bring them to you right now. And then her manager pulls up, the old lady, and she's like, no, you can't do that. And I was like, she already said yes, bro. And then, so, so she kind of goes, oh, never mind, I can't, I'm sorry. And I was like, fuck, bro. And then she asked me, she's like, what can I help you with? And I was like, all right, third time I'm saying the story. I tell her the same thing, what I do and blah, 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 that, or what I was trying to do, get the box, buy it, if, you know, they didn't, because the whole, the whole reason they didn't want to open it was because they didn't want an open case to take out one car and then take all of the rest of the back. And I was just like, that's why I offered several times i'll buy the whole freaking box that's not a problem and so they they weren't having it and she goes we've had way too many uh collectors coming in and buying these boxes and we're just tired of it and we're not going to deal with it anymore in the back of my head i'm thinking you're thinking of the hot wheel scalpers and resellers you're just assuming i'm one of those and i tell her i was like i'm not here to like resell or anything i tell her I, I'm here because this is what I do for a living. This is my job. I do this for YouTube and I collect these cars. And then she's like, oh, sorry. Well, we just can't unless these shelves are start running empty. Then we'll bring out that box and open it. You just have to be here when that happens. And I was like, probably like maybe two weeks from now, if anything. Um, so then I pull I pull a joke on her or like a the, the YouTube card on her. And I'm like, um, so no special privileges if I'm a famous YouTuber. <laughs> And she's like, no. And I was like, what if this is my job and my life depends on it? She's like, no. And I was like, what if I collect these and like, you know, I do YouTube videos on them. Like, I just kept saying that sort of like stupid stuff. And she just kept saying, no, no, no. And at this point, there's four supervisors surrounding me. Like if I had stole something and I'm like, this is so unnecessary. Like as me and this other old lady were talking, more supervisors just kept showing up to the cars out. And it's just surround. I'm just surrounded by a bunch of employees now that are supervisors and leaders and managers and whatnot. Like if I had stole something and I'm there with empty hands with nothing but my car keys in my hands and I'm like, dude, and they were all staring me down so ugly. Like, like, if, like I said, like if I stole something from their store, I was just there asking if I could buy a box of cars and they weren't having it. So I was like, okay, whatever. Thanks for your time. I start walking out that aisle and I turn around. They're all staring at me and I'm like, why the ugly stares, bro? Why? But anyways, it doesn't matter because I was able to find President Mater today. Granted, it's not Sly McQueen and the Ghost Tractor and all those other ones, but I'm pretty sure I'll find them throughout these next couple of weeks. People are reporting finding those. So that's my little rant slash story on Target. First time I've had an incident like that in, I think, years. And now it was the other way around. Walmart was the kind people because if you saw the clip earlier, uh, so basically the day before today, because well, what's today? Hold on. Today is March 26th. So March 25th, um... I had gone and I asked the lady if she could bring out cars if they had any in the back and she brought me four cases which were like four case C's that you saw in the clip that I played earlier and she even told me that there was two cases coming in the next day which was the President Mater case they had one on the shelves and then the other one was still in the back so she was really helpful because I mean she helped me get those she told me that the truck came five in the morning it was going to be out already on the shelves by 6 a.m and boom I got President Mater she was really helpful and usually the stereotype is Walmart employees suck and Target employees are better. But this time it was just the complete opposite. Like Walmart was really nice and then uh, Target was just absolute horseshit. But anyways, that's uh, pretty much it. March 27th, back again at the same Walmart where I found President Mater and where they brought out the KCs for me. And it looks like they stocked them here on this end cap. A lot of that space creature McQueen. So it looks like they ended up just stocking them all on here, all four boxes. Okay, Target right across the street, that Walmart we were just at, and they have these new color changers. Uh, the dot cuts and I can get past, but not this one. Absolutely not. It looks way too familiar to the original. I think there's only those two that are new. Everyone else is old. Yeah, but, well, Doc is okay, but Revo Cos here, ew. All right, next Target of the day, here they are again. That golden piss color dot cuts in and Revo Cos <laughs> and Chase Race Lot. Uh, I, I think, yeah, Fillmore should be in this case. 
Is he not here? He's not here. So someone really came in here, bought Fillmore, and left my boy Chase behind. Uh, I had to get Chase and Fillmore through a friend who lives in Missouri. Because I thought my area was never going to get Chase and Fillmore. Because they can't even sell crews to begin with. So it is April 5th here at a grocery store called Soriana in Reynosa, Mexico. I live 30 minutes from the border. So this was a quick little hop over to look for diecast. And they have the rodent marker case i know radiator springs lightning mcqueen is in this case too but i guess someone took it um, you have your usuals like gearston and never sell uh, as far as the rest of the stock there's really not much else to look at two packs color changes all about the same as in mccallan um, i've actually never seen rodent marker at all in mccallan so this is a w okay second and final store so i came to this other soriana um, compared to the other one that had rodent marker this one's a lot worse because all they have is this and the typical ghost cars that no one buys and the green dildo yep and uh they have these like plastic cars that no one really cares about and then hot wheels as always empty just a really really bad assortment of toys in general there's a little box down here i wonder what that is hot wheel cars of some sort but not individuals oh well well that was a uh, reynosa mexico in a nutshell so I'm outside my house watching the solar eclipse and man, I wish I was in Dallas right now. Like, I don't get it, bro. Why'd it have to be cloudy today of all days? April 10th and at a Walmart. I honestly wanted to end this vlog slash hunt on a high note with Cave Mater, Slime, Deputy McQueen, and the Ghost Tractor. But for whatever reason, Walmart, ever since that President Mater case, have not restocked at all. As a matter of fact, only one Walmart in my area ever got that precedent mater case. No other Walmart in my area has stocked at all. They've all looked like this, which is why I haven't really recorded it at them. I'm going to go to one more Target across the street as well. And I think we're going to end the hunt there. Bit of a disappointment because I'm seeing a lot of stores like in California and stuff. Finding plenty of that case with the cave mater. So that'll be probably for the next hunt video. Holy shit. I just pulled up to the Target across the street I just mentioned, right, right? Ain't no fucking way. Bro. Oh, there he was hiding. Oh. <laughs> oh my gosh, they're like overstocked. Look at this. That is how you end on a high note. Oh, look at stock on the new packaging for this year. Well, new, quote unquote. They got like red. Do they have the intro remote? Uh, not intro remote, sorry. The Cars on the Road Ramon? Not yet. Slime McQueen, bro. <sighs> there we go. Those three are the highlights. This guy, too. Oh, there's two of them. Adam, Chick Hicks, Jackson, Punchy Wipeout, A Day Smokey. On the Road McQueen. Tumbleweed McQueen. Dude. I mean, a lot of these are older releases, right? That I already have. The main highlights being uh, those three right there. You could count one of these guys too. Oh, I can see the Hot Wheel scalpers drooling over this one just because it has metallic paint. Chick Higgs. One of my favorite two packs right here. Shifty Drug. Very nice. I'm waiting for them to re-release Tank Coat from Cars 1. Ghost Tractor. Wow. This is definitely going to be the thumbnail for the video. Oh my goodness. Well, I guess that's going to wrap it off here for this hunt video, guys. Hey, I'm asking you. No, I'm asking you. What is your opinion? Are you creating a whole Why am I not surprised that they weren't scanning in the system? You know what's weird is that they're just basic singles. It's happened to the same target. At the same target, I had the same issue with the color changers, uh, yellow to red, Cruising McQueen, and some other one. I forgot which one came out at the time. I think it was DJ. Yeah, it was DJ. And a manager had to come over and they came out cheaper. So these weren't showing up. I could have called the manager over and maybe they would have given them cheaper, whatever. But I honestly didn't want to waste my time. So I was just like, just scan the Radiator Springs McQueen four times. The thing is, 
I had bought that guy and Rodent Marker on eBay for I think $7 each because I thought my stores are never gonna get them. I just can't find them. I just can't seem to find them. And Mexico has Rodent Marker, boom. And now Target has Rodent, uh, freaking Radiator Springs McQueen. So I'm just here like, man. Anywho, that's not the point. I ended up just buying those four cars, but imagine if I didn't grab the Radiator Springs McQueen, I would have had to go back to the car section, grab some ran random car, maybe like, I don't know who, and just scan it four times or I don't know. I'm just glad I grabbed it, even though I bought one on eBay already. That way I could have just boop, 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 scanned them. So, I mean, I just ended up buying, yeah, McQueen, the tractor, Sly McQueen, and the uh, Ooga Booga Mater. You know what's crazier too? I was just looking on eBay last night to buy them. You know, the Ghost Tractor, Sly McQueen, and Mater. I am so glad I did it, and I'm glad I held off 24 hours. Those are the, the new ones, and really the only ones I really needed. I, although I was very tempted with getting the other ones, like the the piston cup racers and all that, and the second a second tractor, but I'll leave those for the other collectors in the area because there's a lot of other collectors here in the area too that follow me. So uh, I'm gonna drop the location. Well, by the time this vlog comes out, it'll be April 12th. I don't know if they'll still be here by the weekend, but it's a target on Nolana. In case you guys were wondering, to my McAllen collectors, let me let me just pull back real quick out of my parking spot so you guys could see the building. It's this target right here. So yeah if you're near nolana come to the target they got a case before anyone else really i think that's case d if i'm not mistaken yeah so that is a fantastic way to end the hunt video so now i'll end it here and i will see you guys in the next one